Good morning. So today's Saturday and I woke up about an hour and a half, like around 5 a.m. And now it's 6.37. Um, so today I have like a full day of things. I might go to the gym if Saul wakes up. Anyways, um, I have to go to the gym. I have to do my eyebrows. We might go to see the Lion King movie that just came out with Giselle. I have to do grocery shopping. We might go to the park. And then I might go do my nails depending on what time it is. Because if you see... My nails are like... Peeling off already. See? <laughs> so I have to go do that. And... That's it. We're gonna play basketball. Um, I'm tired. Where's the recycling one? Uh, it up. What the heck? Why? Do mm -hmm. people recycle? Mm -hmm. Oh. Okay, I'm completely <sighs> drenched in sweat right now. <sighs> it's like when I go to the store with him and Giselle, it's like. I'm always feel like I'm the only one by myself and they're like a group because like for example we went to the mall on Friday and I just got like I had to get a couple of things and so I had to try things on and both of them like the same thing like oh when are we gonna get food are we gonna get food are we gonna get food like uh mom are we done like can we go get food I'm hungry like that's all they talk about all the time when we go out like uh, so are we gonna eat <laughs> I've been trying to sell some things on eBay I have two comics that I found at this little book store, book, book sales, not book store, book sale. Um, it was outside and they had like a full on like <clears throat> a tower of comics. So I got two that I think are of value, I'm not really sure. Like I checked on Google and things like that and I saw that they were too old before so I put them on. I still have to put on another comic that Saul gave me. We still have our Kalahari trip, which is literally in two weeks. I usually book Thursday to Saturday because they're cheaper days. However, I started a new job and I don't feel comfortable asking for two days off, like taking them off. I just kind of started and I feel like that's kind of rude. So I changed the dates from Friday to Sunday. Um, we are still planning like maybe going to the beach, right? To the lake. I mean, lake the lake with like his whole family so we'll do that and then I think that's about it for this summer I'm still trying to look for like more book fairs or like book sales and flea market sales which I didn't really see all that today which is weird because the past couple of weeks I've been seeing them consistently but today I didn't see any of them and it's funny because I want to start today like getting stuff to resell but 
it's, yeah, it's probably people are just too hot for them and they're on the beach anyways. It's like 96 degrees. Um, and yeah, it feels really hot though. Like, we played basketball, but I just couldn't do it after the second game because I literally felt like I couldn't breathe. Like I had to walk on like where um, there was, what's it called, shadow? Shade. Oh, shade. Where there was shade, so like I can calm down because I couldn't breathe anymore and I was like. And then my makeup, my mascara, I guess, was dripping on my eye and it was burning. I don't wanna waste time taking it off, so I just leave like that. Shouldn't do that anymore, but I'll probably keep doing it because I just, I don't learn. Okay, so we just finished our run. I think it's only 5K, 10K? 5K. It's, it's 10K. Because wasn't that a 10K when we came back for the volunteer run? That's 5K. Really? Yeah. It feels like 10K. So it's 5K run. <laughs> and it's hot. But it wasn't that bad because of the... Um, I forget this word all the time. I hate it. Huh? Um, the shade. <laughs> It wasn't bad, too bad because of the shade and the shade like cools me down a little bit, so that's not too bad. But actually there's a lot of people here today. Like people don't play, people don't care about the weather, <laughs> clearly. Because people are just here running, walking their dogs. So I just came out of Stop and Shop and Target. The good thing about um, here is that they're right next to each other almost, so I didn't have to go far. So I got Smart Water at Stop and Shop. I think if you buy five, they come out to 79 cents. And if you buy smart water, like the big medium sized ones, like you know that they're expensive. They charge you like $3, $2 for a bottle sometimes. Raul got Gatorade, he got four, but they were on sale. They were also like 88 cents each. Yeah, for the huge ones. So that's good. I got grapefruit, because sometimes I'll eat grapefruit. I don't eat it every day. I got two of them, two for three dollars. I think that's all that was expensive for me. <laughs> but, you know, it was only two. I got kombucha, and I got two drinks, because if you buy one, you got one free, and one of them in each is $3.79, so I got two for $3.79, so that's like $1.40 around there. Um, and I drink those, because those <sighs> help me also, like, with my digestion. Like, if I feel like I have a day where like I just ate certain things that I just don't want in my body, I'll drink one of them and then it'll help me digest them. So I got apples, so Yay. you better eat them. Yay. Yeah, the gala apples, I think. No, red delicious. Oh, red delicious apples, red sorry. Delicious. And they were $1.99 per pound. So we only got like a pound 38. Yeah, one pound 38 ounces. So my total came out to be, let's see. Okay. Total. So it was 37.78 after savings. <clears throat> so my balance with tax was 38.26. And that was my balance. For Stop and Shop, I bought a toilet brush because our old toilet brush which is funny because the old one is from Ruben Essentials, which is Target brand. And I scanned the Target brand one and it was like $12. And then I went and got the actual one that's branded, the I think Clorox brand, and it was like $7. But then again, I'm assuming it was on sale because it had a red ticket on it. So I was like, yeah, like I'm gonna buy the brand because why am I gonna spend $12 on one that I could get for seven dollars. Yeah, it made no sense. So I got that, and then I got Comet. Comet is um like a cleaning supply, like for like the bathroom. But I like the Target one because Target has like the different scent ones. So I like the lavender one, and I can never find it anywhere else, which is weird. I just find the regular ones. So they only have the the lavender scent one. So I come here to get those. And then I got cereal, the the cinnamon ones. What they call those that you like? Cinnamon No, the other brand. Those are different brands. It's from General Mills, but it's a different brand. Um, but it's like cinnamon toast crunch, basically. I got the family. Grams? Yeah, I think that's what it is. So we just came back 
I apologize, I could not vlog because before I start, just I need to show you something. My horse. So, I could not vlog because I was sweating like everything out. So I was like, you know what? Well, that's not gonna happen today. But anyway, he bought me this book. He says it's a really good book. I really don't know. I've heard about it. The Time Machine by H.G. Wells. Um, whatever. Thrilling story about a journey into the far distant future. It was like $5. I don't know why that was so expensive. But I got these discs. I will link my eBay account on the bottom here if anyone's interested because I am going to put them on eBay. I'll probably do it right now. Check how much the prices are and then we sell them. Here we have here we have Carol King Rhymes and Reasons and it's a record. As you can see, I need to take pictures of it so I can upload it and this is like some of the CDs that they have. I mean CDs. Songs. Sorry. That. So that's the first disc I got. I got this Johnny Cash songbook. And this is how it looks like. It's a little old. But it's still pretty good condition. And this is the back of it. I got Neo Diamond Serenade and this is the bag, excuse the mess, here. And then the last is Dino. And then this is the thing that I'm most excited about, I'm hoping. The guy that sold this to me said that it's from Germany and um, you know. And it's cool because you can actually put smoke like something here and then it'll and then you can turn it on and the smoke comes out of his pipe. So I'm um, trying to be as careful as I can because you know I don't want to break it. This is what it looks like. It's so cute. It has a little um pipe here and it has a little bag here and the back he has like a gun sort of you could tell that it's really old he has a little puppy in the bottom there and it's really cute i still have to look at the pricing for this but if he he said it's from germany it's very old and you can tell that it's just you know like a good um item to be sell so i'm leaving it here because i don't want to damage it I don't know what this is, but oh, I think this goes in here, and then that goes in there somehow. So those are all the items I'm going to resell. I think this miniature thing was fifteen dollars, and that's a really good price for it. Well, so oh, telling me it was a really good price for it. I kind of was like, ant eh, because it like just seems really old. But he says that I might be able to make something off of it. And then the records, I googled how much they would be, and each of them were like two dollars or something. So I'm gonna resell them for like maybe half or more than half, and get some money back for those. And I think that's all we got. His parents got some things for their house. I didn't get anything personally, just because. I don't know that's not really my focus when I go into flea markets and things like that I'm more focused into like getting like a good price for things I'm gonna resell so I have to do that I only have like an hour I think I think it's about one o'clock and then we have to go downstairs we forgot to give her the cupcakes because Yanni which is Saul's niece um wasn't downstairs she, she went with her dad for a little bit um so we're gonna go eat Applebee's around 3 o'clock for her birthday just have like a little birthday dinner come back get ready for tomorrow because you know we gotta go to work tomorrow I gotta get up early so I has to get up earlier and yeah